Hi, I'm Dr. Dirt. I'm trying to create a school full of stewards of the Calaveras River. And we're, we're going to try to teach them and learn from the, what they discover in the way of plants and animals that they can find on this one outing here at this section of the Calaveras River to see if uh, we can uh, help with the, the uh, uh, vegetation uh, restoration work that's being done uh, on ULP side uh, down by the footbridge. Uh, it's important that we have uh, trained people that can do that kind of work because the river partners need to have some good data come out of that. And so we're, we're doing two things. We're trying to create uh, a sense of this place and an investment of interest in it, and then we're going to try to see if we can't get them to be competent scientists at the very least. Okay? What is it? It's a butterfly. It's a butterfly? We got wow, one. awesome. We got another one. And we got a big one. We got a big one. We got a big one. What are you guys drawing? A ladybug, two ladybugs that we found. Really? Cool. Are you drawing it right there? Can I see your drawing? Yeah. I think Tony has a pencil. Wow, cool drawing. Oh, hi, I'm Richard Anderson. I'm a retired professor from Odessa Junior College. We've come here to help Dr. Dirt do his work with the kids. It's really great to see them out in nature and excited about seeing what they're finding. And so, well, we just found this Hoplia calipigia, and the kid's drawing a great picture of it. It's really wonderful to see such enthusiasm. Can you tell the camera what that is? Is this true? Uh, that's a Hoplia calipigia. 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 Yeah, good drawing. Hoplia calipigia. Good. And you could get in close on that uh, specimen if you wanted. Uh, that's uh, the back side. Cool. Can he see that just to take a quick picture? Great, thanks. Is it still here? Yeah, there it is. It's, uh, well, it, wait, uh, there. Oh, boy. Look at this big Okay, it's this one. Mm -hmm. uh, how many legs does it have? Let me see. I can only see three right now. Oh, there's no one crawling. There's no one crawling with your hand. With your hand, with your hand, blocking the other body. No, it's not a beetle. That's a true bug. That's called a harlequin bug. What does it do? It eats plants. Hi, I'm Lynn Hansen, and I'm part of the TOPS program out of San Joaquin County Office of Education. Uh, I've been involved in environmental education with children for a really long time. And uh, my friend and I, uh, her name is Meg Gonzalez with the Tuolumne River Trust and myself, um, we have written a curriculum called Trekking the Tuolumne, which then was adapted to the um, McQualumne River and is, in the case of the, it's called the Trekking the McQualumne, and it's operated out of the uh, Lodi Unified School District, and the Trekking the Tuolumne is operated out mostly in schools in Stanislaus County. This is the most important kind of activity for children. They learn to explore the outdoors. They learn not to be fearful of it. And they also learn to appreciate the river systems. And when you when you get to know something, you get to love something, you get to protect something, you have interest in it. So this is a very important...